Welcome back to the channel. Hope you enjoyed today's sound effects. Brought to you in part by the dog walking in and interrupting me right when I started the video. But anyway, moving on. We're going to do a flippy flip jumpy jump to uh, the valet uh, amp. If you don't know uh, why it's called valet, uh, valley is because there's a beautiful majestic valley in the background. You cannot see it because we built this uh, beautiful uh, man-made metal structure which is much more majestic as you see. If you have not done so already uh, you will add uh, certain traps at certain points to uh, make Mitch Rob's uh, build work. And basically this has a high propane chance. You will need to uh, combat that uh, high propane chance with the uh, sound walls. One of the, a couple of the main sound walls is down there and uh, these walls right here are important to knock them down once or twice. Once they reach this point right here, this is the kill point. We will need as much uh, or not as much, as much as necessary uh, because our st structure limit is limited so uh, we'll have to add damage at the end of this for a couple uh, uh, husk, husky husk and propanes that have lost their propane they will walk directly into this amp if we do not kill them or uh, Sometimes uh, I like to use my ear splitter and you can just sit there and just ear split them right at that juncture point and that, that easily covers it. Moving on. Now we're going to really quickly cover the west side uh, of the amp. The west side of the valley. And uh, if you don't know, the on the west side the enemies spawn over here right there near the lava ball. They will spawn right here. There. They'll uh, gen generally uh, run this way. Those floor launcher or floor launchers, wall launchers. There will push them off, and that's mainly for assassin us. The majority of the enemies and propane will go around this uh, block off here. This block off here is just in case the majority of the propane or something has a problem that's a backup tunnel but mostly they'll come down here we're trying to stun them and knock them off for their five times durability and we're also trying to make sure that we get the propane off of them if they have it and that's that that right there will do so and we're trying to knock them uh, from here on, this is a kill point. <laughs> you, you don't know this already. Th we need to push them into a lo the lava down here. So you will need an impact five, I believe. One, two, three, four. Four. A four impact uh, sh sh should knock them down thoroughly. Sometimes they'll fall off, sometimes they won't, and uh, they'll just recycle uh, back up to the top. And this is the one of the amps that recycling them still uh, kind of sort of works and the pathing along uh, the side here on the valley is perfect for that on the west side of the valley and uh, you, we can add more uh, traps along here if, if you like uh, for uh, a little more slow down but this amp uh, the enemies will will walk directly into the amp and damage it. Besides the mini bosses uh, or whatnot and smashers uh, do not have to really worry about them as much because they usually die uh, or fall in the lava. So yeah. And uh, here's a look at the slinger wall which is mostly necessary for slingers to keep them from slinging from down there once we push them up. 
and here's the, the other slinger wall on the west and the south. The, the block off on the south is important right there. You'll need a, a wall. And some of the block off uh, can be removed. Not not all. It, if you need an extra structure to, you can remove this wall to the edge of the the cliff. You, you can basically m remove a couple squares here and there. Just uh, yeah, two two squares right here and there can probably be removed. And then, and to test that without actually removing it. You, you can just edit it down to like a wall and, and then you'll know you'll know the enemies just edit it down and you know the enemies will still try to go through there yeah. and then if, if you notice that it's it's not you can remove certain block offs and that that's how I determine which block offs is completely unnecessary on the Mitch Robs build and, and this way you can find uh, more structures to add a, a couple more traps here and there to uh, other problem amplifiers which uh, is fun now with the five times no well stunnable funnable enemy update <laughs> yeah <laughs> moving on uh, the, Okay, uh, just a, a little recap. Uh, some of the mini bosses will uh, and smashers will go uh, along here and uh, do a little jump off. And, uh, this is about two. Yeah, see one one tile here uh, away from the edge. Another tile, a stair, stair, and a a, a third stair going a wrap around or or whatever. Yeah, you see. And, and this basically goes uh, right up to the top of the amplifier and this will recycle some of the enemies uh, that actually I don't even know if it works all the enemies always uh, go right to this amplifier and damage it so you have to kill them in it anyway so yeah be sure to kill them on this amp and, uh, so uh, you know, use your judgment. You, you can uh, switch out a certain trap here and there it, if you like. Then a couple of these floor panels if if you have extra room. And uh, yeah, and uh, that's uh, that's Valley uh, right next. Uh, and that's so uh, uh, the way from keyboard spot is down there on that island. You'll need two away from keyboard on the island for all these builds to work. That's the new away from keyboard spot. You, you don't need a material grinder necessarily, but I hope y'all enjoyed today's tutorial and uh, hit hit the like button if uh, it was helpful for y'all. Uh, have a wonderful day. See y'all.